surge doesn't seem to stop. Ohio has now seen 16 straight days of 1,000 plus new coronavirus cases every day. And today the numbers are up more than 1,400 for a total of more than 80,000 cases so far. There are also 21 new deaths reported in the last 24 hours. The total number of COVID-19 related deaths stands at more than 3,200. Local 12's Christian Hauser is live in the Breaking News Center with the latest update from Ohio Governor Mike DeWine. Christian. Paula, eight new counties have gone red in Governor DeWine's system, but there is some good news here in the tri-state that I'll get to in just a moment. DeWine says that these increases are not from large events or restaurants, though, but actually smaller things like pool parties, group trips to hotspots in other states, sleepovers, even a song contest at a winery. Now let's take a look at the governor's updated COVID map. You can see Hamilton and Claremont counties are still red. However, Butler County dropped from red to orange, though it is just barely under that red category. In regard to a statewide mask mandate going into effect in just a bit, Governor DeWine says that masks, testing, and tracing are the right things to do. And the earlier we can cut this off, the better off we'll be. People in yellow counties should wear masks to keep their virus levels manageable, the governor says. Keep as many people alive in this state, uh, have fewer deaths as we can, and keep as, uh, people from getting sick with the understanding that there are a lot of people out there who are watching this today who got very, very sick, uh, went through hell, uh, and some of them have long-term permanent uh, damages. And in some cases, they don't know what that is. So the goal is keep our economy going, same time, keep these cases down.